Hi everybody, it's Sam again. I'm back with another How I Organise video. So this is how I organise my Nuva Drops, my sprays and my powders. So this is actually a nail polish display. If I just pull out the side here and turn it around, you can see how this looks. So it comes flat pack. I got two of these off of Amazon. It's the clear Perspex. I can't remember how much I paid. They weren't too expensive. I think they were around $15.99, but this is a permanent piece of storage and I can't see myself ever really getting rid of this one. And if I did decide to change it, then I'd probably put my nail polish in it. So I do have a lot of those as well. But I like, as I've said before, I like my craft supplies on display. That just helps me know I have them. It reminds me to use them. And it also, I think, looks quite pretty. So I've tried to arrange it really with my favourite colours at the front. You'll see there my three favourite colours along with the lime there. But this is all the Nuvo drops so I have mainly the crystal drops in this one and then it goes into the glitter drops at the back and then I've got the one below which I'll show you in a moment. But I understand this isn't going to be for everybody because you know you might not have the space, you might not you might just want to keep them in a tub which is a bit more compact but I do like to be able to see them and you'll probably you know if you watch my lives you'll hear me or you know say I'm just going to choose a Nuvo drop and it's really nice just to be able to look at this quite quickly and you know pick the the ones that I want so I will link this exact one because there are different versions out there but this one has the depth in all of these little trays to hold these really well so that's the one that just has all of the Nuvo drops in I'll just move the camera down to that next shelf here and I also have this on a little hook I actually just use one of the holes that's already in the bookcase here so I'm not making any extra holes but this is all of the it's the swatch sheets for all of the colours. You've got the jewel drops, the glitter drops and the crystal drops there. It comes on an A4 sheet when you print it but I just then cut it into strips and then I cut them all up. I've got some there that I still haven't got but it's quite nice to take this over to my desk and I can pick a colour and then I can come over here and look at it. So I just keep that hanging next to it. But on this one here I have the vintage drops going into the jewel drops. I've also got some of the stone drops there. Then I've got some you know, different bottles, pixie powders, I've got liquid pals, I've got sprays. So I thought I'd show you this one because you can see the different maybe brands. You may have lots of Cosmic Shimmer sprays, for example, which are these ones at the back. And these again fit really nicely. So you know, if you were looking at having them more displayed so you could see them all. These are Lindy sprays. These, are, these fit, but they, they do touch the side, but they still go in fine. Um, all of these ones here, these are old Imagination Crafts. Pixie powders fit fine, little sprays. The tightest ones are the Perfect Pearls, but these are older bottles, so I don't know if they're still made in that size. But again, they do still go in there. But all of these, even the Nouveau Grande bottles, they all fit in there perfectly. And you could, if I just tilt this up, with these ones here, the, the vintage drops, you could pop them on their side and possibly get extra in. If I just try it actually yeah see so I could get another two more bottles on the end there as well so you can get a lot in here I really like it like I said it's not going to be for everybody we've all got different spaces that we have for our craft supplies this is in the slim billy bookcase which I picked up from Ikea so this is just like an extra attachment I'm still maybe going to move this around again but um, I really like it it fits this quite nicely in and like I said I've just got that hanging on the side so I'll link everything that you see here. You may just be starting off your Nouveau collection. I've pretty much got all the crystal drops but I do have a couple more that I'd still like to get and then I think I'm going to look at getting the rest of the stone drops. But there you have it. So that is how I organise my Nouveau drops, my sprays and my powders. Thanks for watching as always and I'll be back again very soon. Bye!